Hi and welcome to this DC Freeway tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the shop match function in Magic's Movie Edit Pro. Okay, so on my desktop I've got this folder and inside this folder I've got these two video clips which I downloaded from Pixabay. I'll put links to those in the YouTube description. So let's go ahead and open up Magic's Movie Edit Pro and the first thing I'll do is drag this video clip onto the timeline and let's, let's just zoom out here a little bit and we drag the second one here as well. So we've got this video clip here. You can see it's quite bright blue colors in this particular scene. And as we scroll across, you can see this one is much darker. And I want to take the darker sort of water colors and apply that automatically to this particular scene. So when we go over to the effects section, we can click on shot match here. And we'll click on the video clip and it's saying position the playhead marker in a selected object at a location that displays the look that you want to change. So the look that you want to change first. So if we move back here, we can see the sky and the water. So we want to change the look here. So we'll select this clip, target this frame, select target frame. So we'll select that one. And then the next thing it says is position the playback marker in the film at the location which you want to copy the look. So we want to move across to this clip here and we want to copy the look from here. So we select this as the reference and then we click match shot. So when we scrub back across the timeline, we'll see our water is much, much of a darker color now, right? If you compare them as we move across, you'll see they have sort of similar water colors. And you can double check that by clicking on this intensify here. You can drag down and you can see the original colors and now you can see the new ones. So you can see what Magix is doing. It's taking the color grades from here and applying it to this particular video. So if you're doing some filming, Maybe you're doing some unboxing videos or you're doing some filming on YouTube or you're filming outdoors and you happen to be in two different lighting environments or your lighting is set up slightly differently on two different shots when you're doing the camera work. Uh, you can use this function quickly to try and match and grade those video colors so they look quite similar. And you can go ahead and apply other effects to it. So you can click here, for example, on this video. You can go to the brightness and start to change the camera. Um, the HDR gamma, the blur here to improve the scene. You can increase the saturation as well if you choose to do so. And you can apply those same logics to this. So you can start to change the saturation here and try and get those clips to match a bit better. So you can tweak it as well afterwards. It's not a case that, you know, this shot match is going to be perfect, but it would do a pretty good job um, of matching those colors. Now, a bit of advice. If this was like a red sunset and then this was like the blue ocean, it wouldn't work very well, right? So you want colors that are kind of complementing in the beginning. So we had two scenes. This one had quite a light blue color. If we check again, remove the intensity, we can see it's quite light in, in the blue colors. Um, and then we took the darker blues from here and applied it to this particular scene here. So that worked out pretty well. That's how you use this shot match function in Magic's Movie Edit Pro. I thought I'd just give you a quick example of how to use that. Um, and I hope you find that useful. So let's minimize this. Let's close this folder. That's the end of this tutorial. And I look forward to seeing you in the next DCP web tutorial.